Grandma and Grandpa. I hope you have fun. This is some family and friends wanting to share some little special things with you. Bye. Hi, Mom and Dad. Happy retirement. Over the years, I've seen how hard both of you work and the effort you put in. And now as you embark on this next chapter, I'm just excited for you. And I really hope that no matter what it brings, you soak it in and really enjoy it. I love you both very much. Bye. Hey, Tony, Uncle Michael, congratulations. You guys did it. We are so happy for you guys. Thank you for inspiring me to go into education. It is a really tough career, but it is well worth it. You guys have made such a big difference in so many of your students' lives. Um, I only hope that I could do the same thing. So happy for you guys. Love you. Can you say happy? Yeah. Can you say retirement? That's a big one. Yeah. Oh, say grandpa. Pa. Say grandma. Pa. Yay. Can you be a kitty cat? Oh, can you blow some kisses? Do you have any kisses? Aw, thanks, Ethan. I love you. Hi, Tony and Michael. Happy retirement. Surprise! I hope that this next chapter is filled with many more surprises to come. I hope that you take last minute trips and enjoy the simple moments and find some new hobbies and spend lots of time with. Oh. Yeah. Me too. We love you very much and we're excited to celebrate you today and every day. Hi, Tony and Michael. Congratulations on your retirement. Looking back on both of your careers, you both chose paths that made a real difference in the world. Tony, you were a tutor unlike no other. So dedicated and putting so much time and care to individualize your tutoring to the needs of each student. Through your caring, compassion, and knowledge, you empower them to do their best. Michael, you affected the lives of so many young women with your wit compassion, knowledge, and deep caring, you open their minds, helping and guiding them to learn about the world and themselves. Tony and Michael, you both made such an impact on so many lives. Now it's time to spend the next chapter on yourselves. Enjoy, love you both, happy retirement. Happy Tony and Michael. Oh, happy retirement, Antony and Uncle Michael. We hope you're able to relax, and enjoy each other and have fun together. We love you so much. Congratulations. Hi, Grandma and Grandpa. I think I really, my favorite moment with you guys was when we were at Brownstone together. So I, now that you're retired, I think I would love to do more of that stuff with you. Bye. Love you, Amy, Finn, and Mom. And of course, Matt. Hi, I'm Tony and Uncle Michael. Enjoy retirement. Um, we miss you so much and are so happy and excited for you guys. Hey, Tony and Michael. I hope you all are having a wonderful celebration today. Um, I'd love to add my voice to wish you a huge congratulations on both of your retirements and uh, to wish you joy, health, and fulfillment in this new chapter of your lives. Um, congratulations. Hi guys, congratulations on your retirement. I'm so happy for you guys. You deserve all the best and enjoy it. To Tony and Mike, welcome to the next phase of life. Now that you're retired, you can do whatever you please without feeling guilty about taking your ease. No alarm to set, no lesson plans to make, no schedule to keep, no orders to take, no students to correct, no parents to call, only enjoy each day and forget about it all. Lose the laptop, try new things, take a long walk and see what life brings. Forget what day it is, it doesn't matter anymore. Bring home a puppy, that's what life is for. So live in the present and give thanks for the day. Enjoy your retirement the McCarthy way. All my love and many blessings. Congratulations, Michael and Tony. You both have worked so hard for so long. It's time that you guys took a well-deserved break. 
Hey sis, hey Michael, if you're watching this, I am assuming we're all together uh, partying for you and celebrating your retirement. Uh, just so happy for you both. It's been a long, crazy ride. Um, can't believe we're here, but I'm so excited for you both and this new adventure uh, with your new house, which I love, and being so close to your kids. Um, it's, uh, it's exciting. Um, I wish you just fun. I want you to have fun. Uh, us Masex, we kind of know how to be really productive, right? So now's the time to slow down and enjoy what we've built and have some fun. And I'm looking forward to doing that with you. I love you both. Hey, Mike and Tony. Uh, just wanted to say congratulations on your retirement. Um, you both have had very fulfilling careers, I feel. Uh, in your own ways, you have helped future generations to, to do well in this world. Michael on a spiritual uh, sense and, and Tony on a collegiate sense, but uh, both of you, I think, have really contributed to the next generation and you should be very proud of that. Retirement, some heavy stuff. You know, a lot of people have a lot of judgment about retirement. Like, what are you doing with your time? How are you spending it? And it just makes me think of a quote by Robert Hunter said, sometimes we live no particular way, but our own. So I just want to leave you guys with that and a personal message from me, from one retiree to two others. Happy retirement, Tony and Michael. I hope you guys enjoy it and live it in your own particular way. Hi, Tony and Mike. Congratulations on your retirement and greetings from sunny Florida. Wish I was up there having fun with you guys and surrounding you with love and joy at this happy time. And I wish you many adventures and joyful times in your retirement. I have a John of Donahoe blessing for you both, and it's entitled Blessing for Retirement. I'm just going to read one stanza. This is where your life has arrived after all the years of effort and toil. Look back with graciousness and thanks on all your great and quiet achievements. And I know you will continue to make many achievements and your contributions to the world of retirement as well. So I'll see you soon. Bye-bye. Happy retirement! That's from Barry. Tony and Mike, I hope that retirement brings every good thing in the world your way. You deserve it. I freaking love you guys. Michael, on this uh, occasion of your retirement, I looked online for a poem, for the right poem, and I found a haiku for a retiring teacher by Kelly Roper. The greatest teacher is one who lifts his, her students and watches them soar. Enjoy your day. So great to share this friendship with you for so many years. Hey, Tony and Mike, Steve and I just wanna wish you a happy retirement. We are so happy for both of you. You've touched so many lives during your work years and now it's time to have fun, relax and enjoy your retirement. We love you. Hi, Antonio and Uncle Michael. I just wanted to congratulate you on retirement. Um, I love you both so much. Um, and I just wanted to say, I hope over the next couple of years, you can f strike the right balance of uh, relaxation and keeping yourself busy and maybe finding some new hobbies or passions you didn't think you had. Um, miss you guys. Um, and congratulations. A very happy retirement. As you can see, I'm here in Woodstock. I think you should get a bus like this and go cross country because now you have a lot of time and you should enjoy it. Bridget and I say hello. We hope you have a great party to celebrate your retirement and we hope to see you at Connie's. Love you guys. Bye. Here's my retirement poem for you. How awesome for you both. Retirement is finally here. No more wondering where you each are. The answer now is always right here. The days will seem longer, the potential so vast. Can you believe this is your life now? No teaching or tutoring at last? You've each made a difference in the world, done good for person kind. Now you get to explore your heart's desires. How do you want to play and unwind? Wishing you days of good reading, adventures with friends without end, beach walks and fine dining, Time is all yours to decide how to spend. Happy retirement, dear Tony and Michael. You have earned this time of ease. I'm not quite sure when that part actually starts, but when it does, I hope you love doing exactly as you please. I love you both. Happy retirement. 
Okay, so we're just trying to find out, is this horizontal? Yeah, <laughs> I think it is. So, congratulations to both of you. Wishing you guys all the best in your new chapter. Absolutely. Congratulations, Michael and Tony. You deserve the best. Yeah. Love you both. Love you. Bye. Michael, Tony, happy retirement. It's time went by so fast, I can't believe it, but it's time for you guys to kick back, relax, enjoy, travel the world, spend time with family, friends, and most of all, be happy, do what you want to do at your pace, anytime, all the time. Happy retirement. We love you guys. Forgetfulness by Billy Collins. The name of the author is the first to go followed obediently by the title, the plot, the heartbreaking conclusion, the entire novel, which suddenly becomes one you have never read, never even heard of, as if, one by one, the memories you used to harbor decided to retire to the southern hemisphere of the brain, to a little fishing village where there are no phones. Long ago you kissed the names of the nine muses goodbye and watch the qu quadratic equation, pack its bag. And even now, as you memorize the order of the planets, something else is slipping away. A state flower, perhaps? The address of an uncle? The capital of Paraguay? Whatever it is you are struggling to remember, it is not poised on the tip of your tongue, or even lurking in some obscure corner of your spleen. It has floated away down a dark, mythological river, whose name begins with an L, as far as you can recall, well on your own way to oblivion, where you will join those who have even forgotten how to swim and how to ride a bicycle. No wonder you rise in the middle of the night to look up at the date of a famous battle in a book of war. No wonder the moon in the window seems to have drifted out of a love poem that you used to know by heart. Wait a second. We forgot to wish them happy retirement. Hey, Michael, it's Irene. Just wishing you both the best on your retirement. And maybe I'll catch you at the beach. Bye. Hi, Michael and Tony. Uh, congratulations to you both. I know how hard you both have worked. Uh, persevered, actually, Michael, remember? Uh, anyhow, so sorry we couldn't make it there but we love you and are so proud and just so, so happy for you guys. You have a beautiful life there. Okay, guys, congratulations. Wishing you a happy and blessed retirement and the best days you've ever had together coming up in the future. Take care. And again, sorry we missed it. And we love you and hope you have a great retirement. Bye-bye okay, now. Bye, have fun. Hey, Tony and Mike, congratulations on reaching retirement. It's the best time, I'm sure. Michael, um, you traveled many, many years. I hope you can keep whistling and enjoying the future. Tony, um, you are, again, a complete inspiration. I think you know this, um, that I remember calling you one Mother's Day after Catherine got her nursing degree. And I, she didn't know if she wanted to be home more with the kids. And I remember you telling me all about your job. Um, it was a complete inspiration. And um, I'm really proud of both of you. Uh, both of you should really enjoy retirement. You both deserve it. Love you both. Family wishes you all the love in the world. Bye, guys. Congratulations on both of your retirement. I just want to say I wish you both all the peace and joy in your life and whatever you do. Congratulations to both of you. Love you. Bye. Congratulations on your retirement. Best wishes to you going forward. All the best to you. Uh, continued good health and happiness. And there's a little fireworks uh, show for you to celebrate your retirement. Hi, Tony going? and Mike. I'm going to borrow the words of John O'Donoghue, blessing for retirement. This is where your life has arrived after all the years of effort and toil. Look back with graciousness and thanks on all your great and quiet achievements. You stand on the shore of a new invitation to open your life to what is left undone. Let your heart enjoy a different rhythm when drawn to the wonder of other horizons.
Oh no.